own locker. So let's go objects. Let's go, where's lockers? There's a filing cabinet. Uh, guard locker. They cost 200 each. So we can put like um, a guard locker here and here. So now we can afford to get the guards. We just need to save up three grand. Um, oh, that went off. So but no guard went to him. That's interesting. Maybe there's just... I need more guards. Maybe a line here. I don't know. Uh, so... Now let's go staff and hmm. Now this this is the interesting part. So we can get two dog handlers, which is going to cost me five hundred. So if I do that, it takes away a hundred from my thing. So okay, now I've done that. Um, this guy here. So if I go deployment and guard patrols. This guy I'm going to eliminate and I'm going to put a dog patrol inside here. And maybe do a dog patrol up and down here. So then we have the dog the dog sniffing up around here which is good because that's where I think a lot of the contraband is going at the moment. So if we do this, these dog handlers are going to go in there, which is perfect. Alright, so we just I heard a little bell. I think that's all our deploy not deployment, uh, bureaucracy. So now if we go to bureaucracy, we own practically everything. We've got two more things to buy. That's six hundred uh, not six hundred, sixty thousand dollars, uh, which we definitely don't have. We've only got 175. So we are very, very low on cash at the moment. We've got twenty three hundred coming in, just shy of twenty four hundred, which is good. So we just need the time to go a bit. We need to save up to three grand. And then we can assign two armed guards. And then when we do that, we'll get 15 grand straight up, which will allow us to finish this extra prison cells. Which means when that happens, then we get another 20 grand, which then could help us go towards getting some new land, which is what we want. Um, okay, so just waiting for the time to really... Just, just, we just want the time to keep going, getting more money. So we've got staff here, got 10 workers, got a lot of guards, actually. We've got a huge amount of guards. Um, prisoners, jobs, we've only got uh, in the laundry. Needs. Um, drugs is quite hard. Contraband, we probably should do a sweep, shouldn't we? What time is it in the game? Hmm... Should we do a sweep? I say let's do it. Let's do a shakedown. Instantly found. Oh wait, no, that was already the stuff that we found. I want to do a shakedown because it feels like we need to. Found drugs and meds and alcohol and all this stuff smuggled within within the uh, cooking area. So that's good. Got a shank. We found a lot of stuff actually. More narcotics. More drugs. More cigs. A lot of, lot of um, booze and uh, drugs found this round. We've got more prisoners, which this might be good, actually. They're going to possibly turn up exactly when the search is going. So hopefully we search them as well. Do we search them? No, we should put metal detectors right at the front, I reckon, like right here. So, okay, search done. So that's good. What What's our income? Okay, we're, balance is at... 1100 so that's okay get this in fast forward what have we got we've got 67 prisoners we've got um, eight more prisoners coming soon uh, okay this is still really high that's probably just because of the new people that just come in so we need we need to sort that out um, you know, policy and all that sort of stuff grants okay this is where I need to start looking at some of this stuff so we need to start earning some big cash so we've, we've completed a lot of grants. We've spent a lot of money. Um, we've got maximum security. So increase the size of your security force. Unlock body armor through bureaucracy. Unlock tasers. Build a CCTV monitor. And place a CCTV camera throughout your prison. That would be very tempting, actually. That's that's 20 grand just for selecting it, and another 20 grand 
to complete that and we've done majority of that but we haven't unlocked it because it re requires government security rating which is this so we need to do this to unlock that which is more money um, inmate nutrition program um, what is it save a single okay it gives it that just gives us um, completion bonus so it gives us only payment when we complete uh, education reform program again that's a very very lengthy that someone's overdosed up there that's a very lengthy um, process actually prisoner uh, what's this one have prisoners work in your prison in a good way assign three prisoners to work in laundry kitchen and cleaning cupboard laundry kitchen clean cup I, I can do that yeah let's take you straight away we, we can do that okay uh, deployment uh, jobs so we've got there um, we need three in here and three in here so what we can do is we can go jobs in here 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 and here and we go one two three um, let's do that because they're not going to get any of the contraband through here or through here because we're, we're going to be able to see it so let's do that and then that's going to be how much more did it, was it? Uh, it's going to give us 10, another 10 grand. There we go, 20 grand, just straight away like that. So that's perfect. Some twat over here is really overdosed. He's probably going to die. Needs. Um, death by danger, dangerous driving. Okay. He's not, it doesn't say he's, I think it says he's using at the moment. You, go search him or uh, search cell. And search prisoner. Uh, there we go. So we're going to search him, do all this sort of stuff. Yep, found the drugs there he was using. There we go. Alright, so now let's pause this for a second. And let's finish these prisoners and get our capacity up to 100. And then we'll get a further $20,000. Which is exactly what we needed. So, let's go objects, beds... And let's do this. So let's get beds all down. This is another, I think, like two grand or something in beds. Which isn't too bad, I think. Yeah, it's about two grand. Then we've still got jail doors, which is going to cost me four grand. And then we'll have a hundred cells. Then we'll go up to another 20 grand, which is perfect, which is what we need for this prison. We're very low on cash then. And then we can complete a few other of these objectives and get a huge amount of money. So we can do that. These guys can start building that. Uh, let's hit play. Actually, no, let's hit fast forward because I'm going to go staff and I'm going to buy two armored guards right now. And so we can go maybe one and two. And then we should have just earned... Hold on. Do we earn... Oh, oh, wait, I assigned two guard handles to Dog Patrol. I, I swear I, I did that. Uh, yeah, yeah, they're, they're, they're on Dog Patrol, unless I didn't... Unless I didn't do it right. Um, dog patrol. Then let's do armed patrol. Um, let's get rid of all that. And we'll put one armed guard in here. Because I think that's pretty crucial. Put one armed guard there. And where should we put the other guy? Um, maybe have him walking around here or something. Just for now. Put him there. So put two armed guards on patrols. Put two dog handlers to dog patrols. I've, I've done that. Oh wait, hold on. 
<clears throat> dog needs a kennel to sleep. Okay, that's what I'm missing. I'm missing kennels because the dogs are too tired and they're not patrolling anymore. Kennels. I can put the kennels in here, I guess, for now. Until I can decide what I want to do. Dog cage. Is that what I need? Or is there a dog kennel? Uh, I think that's all I need. So let's reverse this. Okay, uh, let's do like dog kennels here and here or something. And we can get them, them in there. Then those dogs, yeah, because they're all tired out. Then, um, so when they're all tied out and these goes in, I'm pretty sure that, uh, why are these people? Ah, oh, it's because the, ah, oh, it's because the dog cages are the other way around. Okay. Uh, dismantle, dismantle, object, uh, dog kennel, uh, place you there and there then. I was pretty sure that's how they had to be done. Wait, no, 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 come, bring it back! You stupid idiot. Alright, so, um, when that gets done, that would be good. We can get these... What, why are you taking it all the way over there, and then for someone to come back and place them right here? Please tell me you're going to place it around the right way. Yes, there we go. So now, one of you should be taking your dog. Like, can you go, like, like here or something, or, like, here? I, I seriously don't know. Unless I need to complete this room. Oh, wait. Hold on. Rooms. Rooms. Is there an actual room for a dog kennel? Bugger. There is. Okay. <laughs> okay. There is. Um. Okay. Well, we could put the kennel over here for now. Surrounded by walls or doors. Okay. Hold on. Will this work? Do they do they actually need like the kennel, like the actual things, stuff? Um. Okay. Hold on. Well, let's turn this into a kennel then. Let's remove that. <coughs> and then those dogs can rest, and then we should get should get exactly what we need. So exactly when they go back onto patrol, we can ignore that. So I need to sort up a proper proper kennel system, which is a bit of a bother. Which I haven't really thought out. <laughs> uh, how big do these rooms need to be? Because this wasn't supposed to be max security or anything. At all. Um, let's have a look. Hold on. What am I looking for? Oh no, I should be in here. How, what's the minimum requirement for a kennel? 5x5. Five five, you know, 4 by. Oh wait, no. Uh, armory. Where's armory? Oh yeah, we got we got the money now. We got the money. Alright, perfect. So we got all the money. We're back up to 50 grand now. Um, kennel's 5x5. Five five. Where is... Bloody... Um, armory. There it is. That one doesn't have a restriction in size. So one, two, oh. where are we? Okay, here we go. All right, so, oh, he's, al he's already sorting him out, sweet. Okay, so let's let's just kind of step back for a second. So we've done, we've organized a few of the kennel stuff. We've organized the prisons. I think the next big thing is to organize this damn front. I think this is what I want to focus on. I don't really have to worry about too much of these guys. Um, I think... Yeah, this this is getting it's getting hard to figure out. Like I wanna know. Now can I go set up a road gate here? I, I wanna test this. We're gonna do a little test over here. If we set it like here. I don't know where to put it. Should we put it here or there? Um like, I wanna know what happens when I set that up. Do they still drive through? Waiting materials. Okay, let, let, let's find out. Uh, large window. Okay, electric chair. Road gate. 
Okay, okay, so these guys activate when they need to, which is perfect. That's exactly what we need. Um, Alright, so now we can go... You could almost put like a little building there, like a little little outhouse building right there to, to control it. So if you go like... Um, uh, like foundations, concrete... And you can do a wall here, can't you, if I'm correct? Yes. So if we go like here, we do like a little five by, well, a little four by four room or something, or should we do like five by five? Uh, you only need, I only need something small. So you do like walls around it, then just like the guy standing there. So make like a little, little room. Should we do like a four by four maybe? Give him a bit of room to walk around. Okay, yeah, we can do that. We'll do that. And then we can go objects, staff doors, here, and here. So now this this will be interesting. So we can get that going. We can get a few of this stuff going. I'm just interested just to kind of make this look a bit more like a structured prison a bit. So these guys are then going to place that and that. Then I'm, I want to know, can I operate this through, because you can go lock open and goes like that. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just interested. So if I go lock shut, then can a car actually get through? Oh, that's interesting. Could I do... Can you, like, search a car, like a truck? I wonder. That, that's an interesting concept. Could you search a truck? Like, say if it was bringing in a delivery of prisoners, could you search the prisoners prior to going through here? That'd be a pretty interesting system if, if that's able to be set up. Uh, but okay, we could just set you to normal for now. Uh, and go play, and then he can be on his merry way. I'm hoping... Wait, wait. He's not. He's not opening now. Oh yeah, yeah. You need. You need a guard to to access to open that door. So now, what we can do is be like um, staff. No deployment. Do a guard patrol. Uh. Wait, hold on. Uh, guard. Uh, guard patrol. Here we go. Do a guard patrol right in here and put a guard there then we can also put this as a staff only building as well uh, this is obviously a staff only building I'm trying to just make sure a few things are staff only which the ones that need to be are so that no prisoners go wandering in areas they don't need to be going wandering in okay now I want to sort out this front the front of this building so you've got this guy he wanders in and out here did I just see someone walk out? Oh wow, okay, so... Okay, so that little room didn't really work. Okay, so this is this is interesting. I'm trying to figure out how to get this guy to do what, he, what I want him to do. Go up patrols. So if I get rid of that... And maybe put him walking from here to here... And then back maybe in here and around here. So he constantly walks and we could have like another one here and he just walks in between the two or something. We can do that. And then we can we can put a wait, patrols, then we put a guard on there. Which is him. So now he walks around, then he can be like, okay, open up, and this guy patrols, he walks up and down and around. Guard comes along, opens the door. Yeah, that that works. That that works nicely. Okay, so, we have got $48,000. Let's go here. Ooh, cell block D. So this one is, wow. Okay, so expand our capacity to 200. So that's double what we have. That does, that's not really a lot of money for that, though. When you look at it, it's 30 grand to literally double what we've had. And I think we've spent probably around about... <sighs> we'd have to spend maybe about 40 to... 80 grand just building all this prisons. So that's that's quite expensive. 
carpentry program. Okay. So what I want to do now, we we can maybe get max security infrastructure going. 